Hey everybody, I'm fun enough bring you a brand new Let's Play. So I haven't been uploading since August 21st. It's now, obviously, September 13th. And I am going to continue on with the LPs that I've been working on. Pokemon Red. Um, what's some of the other ones? Sonic 4, Episode 2. And Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. And now I'm going to do this. Low Adventure Demurio 3. Chilean Retro Gamer is also doing this hack. And I decided that I want to do it. Ten years ago have passed since Mario and Luigi had that big fight. And I do believe this is Chrono Trigger music. Or something similar. The two brothers lived in peace and the Mushroom Kingdom did too. But one day, the peace was no more. Mario heard his cell phone ring. Mushroom Kingdom got cell phone towers now? What is this? Bell, Bell Cellular now? I don't know, AT&T or something? Whatever. It depends on where you live. Hello, you call the Mario Bros. What can I do you for? Ah, oh, it's Peach. Mario, quick! In the forest! I'm not doing any freaking voices. Eh, Peach. Surprisingly, she's not baking us a cake. Anyway, there's two games that come out before this, which I have never played before either. And you're probably wondering, why come I didn't do those first? Well, I wanted to do the newer one. And I'm totally ignoring the freaking text, and I'm hoping you're reading the text. Because I'm reading it, but I'm not saying it. Also, if you haven't already done so, check out Colette on NL180 on Twitter. She's also a part of Much Games Gods with the crew with, with me, Newfie Bonga, Cole NL, Samurai TX, Mr. Kirby, and Valen Dinch, and obviously, like I said, Colette is with that. And she has her own new YouTube channel. As of this recording of this, she only has one video up, and the game she decided to start off with was Mario Brothers 3, but it's the Super Mario All-Stars version. Okay, okay, so if you want to learn the moves, we can go tutorial. So we're going to go tutorial just for everybody else. Professor Luigi. Hey, Mario. It's me, Luigi. And now I will teach you how to many moves you can do. Let's start. The easiest move is the wall jump. You can perform this by simply pressing the jump button when you are against the wall. However, you can't wall jump However, you can't wall jump on one wall. You have to move left to right. Then we have the long jump. My favorite. Just run at full speed and dock and jump. You will jump very far. And in the end you have the U jump. Not useless. All you have to do is run at full speed, go back, and jump. Good for reaching unreachable places. Another thing, if you hit this uh, this block, <laughs> if you hit this block, but you are bored to follow all the explanation, press star and you will skip discussing. <laughs> hey, I don't finish yet. Here's some more tips for you. Okay, I'm gonna skip the rest because you're boring me. But yeah, anyway. And there you go. Now how to do. So that's how you wall jump. Wall jumping was originally um, brought in in Super Mario 64 in 1996 for the N64. Obviously it's a virtual console game. And I just totally fucked up by going back. Anyway. As for Golden Sun, I am going to be doing Golden Sun, but I'm going to take a little break from it, and I want to work on this game and my other hack, uh, things. Why am I bringing up this one? Uh, I kind of figured, seeing how I've been gone, gone for so long, some people might not remember what I was working on. I told you at the beginning of the video that it was Sonic 4 Episode 2. Legend of Zelda Ocarina Time, we are in the Gerudo Valley. And yes, I will be using rewinds and every now and then save saves. Anyway, ooh, shut ah! I don't know what the theme is here, like the music, but uh, I like it. Anyway, here you need, uh, here you okay, so a wall jump. Okay, not hard. Can I go down this pipe? No. A lot of this LP, oh, I can go down this one though. No. A lot of this LP is going to be blind. It's kind of like a Donkey Kong type song. 
It probably isn't, but I think that's what this song actually is from. Touch it and you will hear this switch. And go on. If you don't hear it, do it again. Okay, so you can do it multiple times. Ah! So, in this game, instead of the feather, you have the raccoon suit. Also in New Super Mario Bros. 2. And that's not what I wanted. Stupid. Oh. Oh my god! You spin me right around! It's not like a four water song. Ding ding. You also notice that there's no time on the top of the video how many lives you have or anything like that. That is done purposely. And now we're gonna save state just in case. Like I said, Chilling Metro Gamer is doing this. I'll probably put the link to his channel in the description so you can check out his. He's a bit further than me. Also, you can't keep your previous power up. So I just lost my feather, but I can't like use a drop. Like you do in Mario World, they kind of disabled that feature. I know that Newfie Bonga said he w wasn't watching. I don't think he was watching Chili and Retro Gamers version of this because he wants. Damn it! He wants the game not to be spoiled for him. Unfortunately, I do know a few things that come up through. I didn't see the first two worlds of the game when Retro did it, and he's currently doing it. I saw World Three and Four, and part of World Five. So I know it, but a few things to expect, but by the time I get to those parts, I might not remember what we did. I'm not gonna worry about... I'm not gonna worry about that dragon coin, or if you wanna call it Yoshi coin, or whatever the flack you wanna call it. Oh! I'm assuming I have to. Yes. Damn it! Okay, I can go this way. I'll take the hit. But I won't take that. What? Really? Okay. Oh, okay, I see the gimmick now. I don't think I need you. Oh, right. Okay, so apparently I need a P switch. And you don't make me big. Now, I could go for that, but I'm not worried about that. So let me get my power up back here, and like I said, I apologize for being gone for so... Okay, I thought I was going to, like, you know, die there. I think I know what I gotta do. That is not what I wanted. Wait a second. Oh! Okay, yeah, uh, so it's all about timing now. Coinage? No! 
I'll get my power up back, so I'm not worried. Polar bows, so we got more fire here, eh? No. The LP has curse has hit me because I've been not LPing for. Okay, that was just stupid. I'm. That was just stupid on my part. I really like the music though. No. Jack in the beanstalk. I could get that other coin, but... Oh, cool, I can go up on top of the pipe. So, yeah, and also the uh, NHL lockout's coming up. Uh, if I need any shop bands, I know there's going to be a lockout. It's pretty obvious the lockout's happening. Let's fast forward a bit. So, jumping and scrolling. Okay. Now, I don't know anything about this. I can't remember much about the secret exits or anything like that. So, you're going to have to... Oh, thank God, I don't... Don't die from that. Okay, there we go. What? This is an auto scrolling level. Watch out. Now, earlier, it was telling me I can go up there. So, I'm just wondering. I know I gotta use him. Okay. Give me my power up so I get a mushroom. If anybody knows the soundtrack to this game or where you can get some, what some of the music is, if I don't know it, let me know. Cause right now I don't know. Now here comes the auto scrolling. Okay, so I don't want to get killed by the screen. So, what? Don't tell me. Yeah, okay. So, apparently... Apparently, I can wall kick... Underwater. Okay, so this game is getting a little bit more challenging, but it's nothing we can't right now. And I bet you're just gonna continue on the other side, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> but it looks like the auto scrolling is over with. So, what? Okay. So how the fuck am I supposed to get in there? And hold on a sec. Okay, so we're gonna go there and then we're gonna run. And apparently I'm gonna get a one up. So we need a piece to get that P switch. Okay, so apparently I can only go so far, and then I die. Okay, so I can continue on. This is not death. Okay. I don't know if that's a good thing for me to get rid of that, but I don't want really to kill. Okay, 
Okay, kind of a Mario 1 aspect. What the hell? Alright, that's what I'm doing. There we go. So I guess this level does have a secret exit. How do I get to it though? Uh, let's just do the old fortress and I'll figure out that after. While Mario was walking in the forest searching for Peach, he found an old fortress. Mario stayed still for a second and he said something. Bah, watching this castle reminds me of Bowser. But he died. He isn't responsible for the construction of this fort. My specialty is blowing up castles. <laughs> and this is what I'm willing to do. <laughs> he specialty is blowing up castles. <laughs> We were walking to the old castle, and he had a feeling, a strange feeling, like, I should pull up this castle. Who is there? I heard a noise. I think I'm not alone in here. Time for talking is over. Now I'll pull up this fortress, and then I will be victorious. <laughs> Let's go! Alrighty then. So... Castlevania? Oh, I see it. Yeah. Bye bye, dry bones. Okay, so we have to go down. Now, this game does have a lot of custom music. And from what I've heard, it's actually better than the second reality project. Reload its custom themes. Oh, wait now. Damn it. Okay, not not there. But there is something up here. Oh, just coinage. I don't even know how many coins I got. Okay, somehow I'm doing better in this castle. I guess... Not up there, which is I assumed. Oh, okay. I can't jump through those platforms? Oh, okay. Oh no, you don't try bones. Now, I don't know if I should be using fire or not. Maybe we walked into the next room, but he didn't find a boss. Instead, he found Princess Peach. She's kind of like a boss. Oh, thank you, Miriam. Thank you for saving me, like always. Where's my cake, bitch? Peach, it's good to see you. Why are you here? In this old castle. I don't know. I was walking near the forest and suddenly someone captured me from behind. I always knew Peach liked it from behind, and this just confirms it. <laughs> so apparently, viewers that are watching, Peach likes it from behind, in other words, she likes it ain't on stop. It was very similar to you, <laughs> then again, but I know you will never do anything like this. I don't know, Amelia could. While Amelia and Peach were talking, someone entered the room, breaking a window. Mira saw him and saw him, the one who captured Peach. It's very similar to Mirio, but his hair was shiny and brilliant, red color and two red eyes. Are we talking something like a Super Saiyan or something? That seems like a Super Saiyan 4 from like Dragon Ball GT? Ah, it's him, the one who captured him, me. Kill him, Mirio. Dark Mirio. Hmm, Mirio, kill him. Oh, and what is this? A dark version of me? Well, I don't want to actually who you are, but I think it's sure. You will be killed by me. Nobody, nobody can touch the princess. Peach. Touch. You are such a weird man. Come on, fight. Now we're playing Mortal Kombat. What's in a dark mirror? Okay, hold on a sec.
Oh, I got him right in the ass. Spin top is it. The dog moon. Vanished? Shouldn't that be... I think they mean vanished. Vanished in puff of smoke. Okay, whatever. I think you mean vanished. Mario didn't know if he defeated his opposite. Huh. He is very strong like me. But I succeeded again. I'm the strongest hero in the realm. In this realm, no one will stop me. I don't know, maybe Goku could. They haven't met Link. Oh, Mario, I'm proud of you. You saved me and gave <laughs> and gave a lesson to that thing. Dark Mario, are you sure, Peach? Where are you? Are you still alive? It's impossible. You think I'm defeated, but it's not true. I don't use all my power, but only a little bit. Mario, stop saving Peaches. <laughs> Give her to me, and I promise to leave you alone. Is that all right? Never. I will never give you my princess, you fool. Ha. Ha ha. Imagine if it's like Dr. Wally. <laughs> we'll see. Stupid opposite of me. The Dr. Mario's voice disappeared. The castle is now empty, all evil, because Mario defeated them all. Okay. Come on, Peach. Let's go home. Mario and Peach went out of the castle and searched a way to get to the Mushroom Kingdom. Our hero is going here to give the bad news to the toads. Peachy! Peach, stay behind me. Yeah, Peach, like I told you, Peach likes it behind. Oh, wait. If she likes it behind, I mean, she would have to really be in front of him. So, yeah, that kind of defeats the purpose of what I'm talking about. Anyway, we'll go home now, okay? Okay, Mario, be careful. And then apparently, you just run here to go with us. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, that's pretty much it for part one. Uh, when we return... Common battles, okay. So when we return, I'm gonna see if I can find out if there's any secret exit with jumping score on my own time. I'm not gonna get the secret exit on my time, I'm gonna use a, a backup save state for practice purposes, and if there is a secret exit, I will find it. And in the next part, I will start off with showing it, if there is a secret exit. If not, we will continue on with common battles. So thank you for watching part one of this video, of this LP. Remember, I will be coming back to my other LPs, like Ocarina of Time, Sonic 4 Episode 2, and of course, Pokemon Red. So this is our final enough signing off, saying thanks for being patient while I took almost a month vacation to... Oh yeah, by the way, I didn't explain why. Uh, I'll explain why in the next part. People like Colin L, Colette, Nufi Bonga, I think Zeolite, and a few other people who follow me on Twitter might know why. I know Bonga, Colette, and Sam RTX, and Colin L know. Those four people, most people in the crew know why. But anyway, in the next part, we will take on Calming Barrels if there's not a secret exit in the previous level first. So, see you later, everybody. Goodbye.